What's up core crew? Welcome back to the channel. It's your girl Courtney Janine and I'm back with another video. In today's video, I'm doing another wig review. This is a wig that's not really new. It's new to me, of course, but it's one that even when it first came out, I was like eyeing it, but I didn't pick it up because my color that I wanted was out of stock. I saw this unit on TikTok. The girl slayed it. I wish I like, I definitely liked it, but I like so many videos on TikTok. It's hard for me to find the stuff that I like, like when I'm looking for a specific one. Once she showed it, I was like, oh my gosh, let me look up and see if my color is back in stock. And it was, I am talking about Eltre Carrington, 30 inches in the color Chocolate Frost. I'm super excited about trying this unit out. This is a part of their lace front collection so it should be pretty easy to install i just remember seeing the stock card and how the girl looks so good in chocolate frost so yeah let's go ahead and open this up i can't remember the last lace front wig that i have reviewed or if i've ever tried one i've tried chocolate frost before i tried it with their sleek lay collection um so it has easily become one of my favorite color blends from outre so yeah i'm going to cut this off I've learned because now I have scissors behind me so I don't have to get up well y'all never see me get up but I usually always have to get up <laughs> okay so it is definitely 30 inches y'all see that y'all see that and it's still going I know that's right it's a classic cap so you have the part so it's a lace front wig but it's literally just a lace part wig i think and then it has two combs on the side a comb in the back and then the adjustable strap here is the cap construction for your viewing this color uh, okay i'm gonna try it on well i'm in love i love it okay there's just a couple things that i would note after trying this on i don't think that this is big head friendly at all like i would kind of stay away from this because right now it's super snug on my head and i don't have no hair and i really have like a small head so i'm obsessed with the color i'm obsessed with the style that parting hold on so i just got a mirror so that's why i'm looking this way initial thoughts one, I don't think it's big head friendly at all. Pre pluckness, it is a bit of pre pluckness. Um, the parting is pretty, it's kind of narrow, but you could just add a little bit of powder. I think it would just give it so much more life. Lastly, there is a little bit of hump on this side, so I need to go in with a bit of heat to lay this down it does remind me of the sleek leg collection it does remind me of delilah a little bit but i think that this is cheaper not sure the lace reminds me of the sleek leg collection and this is heat safe up to 400 degrees and it's hg transparent lace it also comes with baby hairs it's not super pre-plugged but you guys know how i kind of you know when it's a middle part and you're not really going to be showing your edges like that i don't have an issue so yeah, you guys, this is the hair. I am about to go do my makeup and then I'll be back to install this unit. Hey y'all, okay, so I'm back. Makeup is done. I literally just finished um, just hot combing the top of the wig. You all know that I usually speed up my install process, so I'll always let you know that if you are looking for a step-by-step -step tutorial, definitely check out my How to Slay a Synthetic Wig video. It is on my channel and I go in step-by-step -step what products I use, how to do all that. So, the only thing that has kind of changed is that I have switched out my bed head hairspray for this bedhead hard head hairspray so it's the extreme hold version um i don't know they just haven't been selling the original bedhead in the stores anymore so this is the one that i can get my hands on but other than that it's all the same so definitely check that out i'm going to speed through this install process and i'll check in with you guys once the wig is installed for like my final thoughts so yeah talk to you soon Hi 
Breaker Crew, I am back with the final look of Miss Carrington from the Outright Lace Fronts collection. <laughs> now I'm about to go into my pros, cons, and my final thoughts. So in terms of cons, honestly, okay, it's it's one of those things where I like to say it's a warning instead of a con because you can tell on the stock card that like the curls don't go all the way down. Um, so that's one thing to be aware of in terms of an actual con though is that this unit, it is long so you would honestly expect that this unit will kind of tangle and mat up and I did experience that um, not so much up here but definitely at the bottom like I need to constantly put my fingers through it so it doesn't look tangly and like matted you know in terms of pros absolutely adore this color i actually really do like the style especially it's a look when you're like since it's 30 inches like it is really long so if you are taking like pictures or things like that and you only need like your chest up you don't even have to worry about like where it's tangling which is towards the bottom of the unit didn't experience any shedding but tangling for sure but in terms of pros i really do like the style as you can see it is like my type of go-to type of look you know they do like the color you guys know that chocolate frost is one of my favorite color blends because it is literally just like a brown color but it has a lot of different like highlights in it which is really pretty what else i really like the color you guys know that chocolate frost is one of my favorite color bins from outre period so it is like that perfect beginner color if you're scared of dumping into like the blondes and all that or the ginger browns the havana browns i would suggest starting with either chocolate swirl or chocolate frost and then making your way to like the ginger brown havana brown all those i am going to be doing a whole like my top five video on my favorite color blend so definitely stay on the lookout for that video okay another pro is it is just a lace front so it was pretty easy to um lay this down i didn't have to deal with any baby hairs i didn't have to deal with too much of plucking because there was no room to pluck so this is like one of those collections where um you can easily install this unit it's very beginner friendly um it was a little bit pre-plucked but you couldn't pluck it anymore because there wasn't much lace to pluck um but all in all in terms of final thoughts i think that this is a really pretty unit of course it serves a look which that is a given with outre units um i don't think it's every day because it is 30 inches unless you're that girl and if you're that girl make it every day okay period um another reason why i don't see it as an everyday unit not only because of the length that is a big deterrent for me deterrent is that a word it's a turn off for me in terms of an everyday unit because it's so long but if you are that girl another thing that i would say that makes it not so much of an everyday unit is the fact that it is tangling on me and i literally filmed a 20 minute video like you know what i'm saying like 20 minutes to film it but you guys know i cut down but 20 minutes to like install plus sit down and tell you guys and it's already tangling i cannot imagine wearing this on an everyday basis how the unit will react to everyday wear if it's already tangling up on me during this review you know but as I said before, she is serving a look. So I could definitely see this for like special occasions. I could see this for a photo shoot. Like I mentioned before, it is tangling only at the bottom. Like the hair is super duper soft. Um, and it's literally only tangling at the bottom of the hair. So you could honestly cut kind of the loose ends. So as you see on the stock card, how it's not always wavy it kind of stops if you cut it right there you might have a better chance at wearing this every day and also um to kind of limit the tangling that i experienced the last thing that i will know and it's not it's neither a pro or a con but i mentioned this during the beginning portion of this video that this unit is not big friendly at all <laughs> like i i literally tried this on and i was like wait it's snug like it's really snug so if you have a big head i would definitely definitely stay away from miss carrington 
all in all i hope you guys enjoyed this video let me know your thoughts on carrington did you try her when she first came out i think she came out about five months ago which in outre land is like 50 wigs ago so y'all might have forgot or you didn't even know that she came out but she is super duper pretty she kind of reminds me of delilah but um not from the sleek lay collection so you guys know that i had to put a little bit of heat but i honestly don't think it's the wig i think it's like the fact that i'm allowing my hair to grow out and i kind of want to cut it again because i feel like i'm not able to lay down my units as like scout let me know in the comments but yeah i think i'm gonna cut my hair one i probably i think i'm gonna keep on cutting it at least until like january or so and then i'll kind of let my hair grow out or yeah i don't know but it's like that weird stage between being bald and being like long enough for your hair to actually be at a point where you can braid it down that's a long period of time so that's the time that i don't really want to go through so we'll see i don't know but yeah, all in all, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know your thoughts on Outre Carrington down in the comments. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye, guys.